Hello, my Minecraftians. If you can, if this is working, hopefully, this is my first Minecraft video. And what you are seeing is my very first Minecraft Let's Play. I am Caboose, the Vehicle Destroyer. Uh, no, I'm not the Vehicle Destroyer, I'm just funny. What we're going to do today is probably, hopefully, make a new Minecraft Let's Play series on my channel. So all, su all subscribers will be treated, well, all my loyal subscribers, be treated with a weekly let's play system and if if it's not weekly it's probably gonna be either a daily because I'm always on Minecraft or you know, twice a day or I mean, not twice a day but twice a week at least and what I just did was collect wood if this is your first Minecraft video ever this is a uh, one of the two main components you need to collect during the first night before the first night falls. For this will help you make tools, weapons, sh shelter, torches, which torches will help you, you know, keep monsters at not at bay because they can walk into light, but they can't spawn in the light. And well, you know, we found lots of coal right here. Oops, why did I put logs down? You don't need logs. Logs are pretty much a useless material. Except for their broken down version, which is planks. Each log it gives you four planks, and four planks you can make a crafting table. And each crafting table can be used for building materials such as sticks, which can be used to make picks, which you can use to mine coal, which you can use to make torches, and thus keeping you from being mauled in your sleep. I could have I saw something moving down there. Sorry, me and my paranormal, me and my not paranormal. Well, yeah, I'm, I do have paranormal leaves. I could, I could have sw Oh my god, there's a creeper down there. Minecraft Creature 101. Creeper. The most obnoxious beast on the face of the earth. And I think- Oh my god, he's coming closer! Away with you, demon! Why am I beating you to death with a pick? I will beat you to death with a stone. Die. Jeez, most of the time... The first creature people see in the Minecraft world is usually a skeleton. Because those are the those are some annoying ones. But now, to me, they're creepers. Because if you're too close to them, they explode. And they hurt. And they damage stuff that you put together. So, yeah. If you do that, right? Hold on. Sorry, girlfriend was texting me. Which I'm gonna need to make another pick soon. And we'll keep track of this cave for now because we have to go build our home before nightfall. You need quite a bit of sticks for this. See, if you put. When you're building in items in the crafting table, you have to draw them. And it's not just in the crafting table. As you saw when I was building my workbench in the logs, you have one small crafting table right here in your inventory, which is an automatic one that you don't even have to build or anything with that. 
and it's it's not really that helpful because there's not really much you can build within four squares. They're mainly like the, within the nine square region. And so each time you wait, what was I getting at? Oh yeah, we have to build our house. So we'll just recollect our workbench, which if you just destroy it, doesn't matter what kind of tool, what kind of item, doesn't matter. You can collect workbenches with anything. And let's see. Jump, 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 jump. Uh, let's see if I can find a good, sensible region for my house. <laughs> that looks funny. Ooh, what's that? Whoa, look at that. Oh, this is nice. This is Oh jeez! Ah squid. Squid save me. Die you beast. Die. Sorry about that. I hear another one. No, it's a pig above me. Never mind. False alarm, peoples. We're all good. It was just a pig above me. Oh my god, there's like three tunnel systems here. Which again, we'll explore later after our first night. Which, I should probably get to collecting resources and... Like, this is actually a really good place for a home. For one, you don't... you don't really have to work that much to make a structure. See, instead of building houses, I build... I just dig out caves. I mean, for one, they're pretty much pre-made houses. You just need to cut them out of the stone. Just collecting some dirt here. Making the roof more... clean. I mean, I'm not one of those OCD Minecraft players where they'll go, Oh my god, my house is uneven, I can't live here for now. Not until I clean it up a little bit. Oh, look at that. I have a little water source here, too. I've got a little stream. Anyway. That's weird. I would laugh if there was a cave right there. Is that what I think it is? Oh my god, that is perfect. Within feet of our house. Oh, dear God, I'll have to continue the house later. I've been too busy gawking at the stuff around here. Running, running, running. Hey, look, dirt. And I'll show you the horrors of, horrors of the first night, possibly in this video. What you just heard, well, if you can hear stuff in here, is a pig. There's a pig walking around. And see, like, when you have a house, do not build it like this. Because mon there's some monsters that can spawn that are skeletons that can shoot arrows at you. So, when you're like this, you're not really safe. So, build it like this. At least I do. Oop. Like Spike. I mean, since this world is randomly generated, you'll tend to have a bunch of lags. Because it's generating from the sky to the bottom of the freaking planet. Which is bedrock, and you can't go further than bedrock. Which, if this Minecraft is successful, and we get to bedrock episodes, Yeah, well, you'll probably get to figure out what bedrock is. Uh, hold on, people. Sorry about that, folk. Apparently, I am death mode, apparently. Oh, man, that is cool, though. You can see the lava from here. 
that little light over there is lava. And it, hopefully if there's no monsters running around here right now. Which I see two squids, which thankfully are harmless. Nothing's going to jump down from above me. I hope. Your man making this as a house is going to be freaking going to require a lot of dirt and lots of stone. Because look, I have to reach it from there. And this will be an epic house when it's done. Which probably won't be done for quite a while. So stick with me as I build the house and you'll probably get some good pointers. And God, how did I miss dirt? Now be careful when you're digging around gravel like this. Because gravel, which if I... Ah, uh, here. That gravel right there is my best subject. Sub subject. Something's walking around behind me. Okay, never mind. See, so watch. That is gravel right there. This is all gravel. And watch what happens when I delete that dirt block underneath it. Gravel falls. It is subjected to gravity. So is sand and gravel. Well, mainly gravel and sand. That's really the only things in, besides the liquids, which are lava and water. I mean, everything else is pretty much defies the laws of physics. And I know I'm getting ballsy right now, but I'm gonna see what's in this cave. Is that what I think it is? Nope, it's a rock. It's just stone. Jesus, that's a skeleton! Now, if you ever get into a situation where there's a skeleton, do what I do. And you're probably thinking, oh, hide in the corner. That's very brave. Not what my plan is. Try to figure out where the skeleton is. Okay, so he's still over there. We're going to do a flanking maneuver. Since he is one square down, we have to dig two squares down. That way we're at his leg level. And what you can do is you can follow the sounds of s skeletons. They make like a bone rattling sound. Hello. I will chop your nuts off. Whack. Ha. Those are those annoying jerks called skeletons. Oh my god, I love these caves. I love it when I find caves like these. I make these babies outposts all the time. Heck, and one time I even tried to... Oh, really? Whoa! Is this what I think it is? Oh dear god, it is. This is where we first found coal. Oh, that is very interesting. That's so cool. But anyway, there's quite a bit of coal right there. But since we're not in the need of coal yet, I mean we are, but this is just our first video. Be careful when exploring around areas where there's an open area above you. Because there are spiders the size of dogs. Jesus, and that's another skeleton. Let's see if I can. Tr let's see if I can trick this little fart into the lava pit. Zombie. I hear a zombie. Be careful falling from the sky like that. Unlike most mobs you can die from falling damage like the spiders who can kind of get fall damage but just not a lot since they can climb and that skeleton's apparently retarded
Unruly creatures of the night. And see, like, you're probably thinking, oh, they're not that bad. That's because we haven't seen the spiders yet. I mean, we've already discovered creepers early in the morning. I mean, the first thing in the morning. See, like that. They can. Those things can drop from the sky anywhere. And that's why we build a hidden room like this. <laughs> yeah, see? Well, that plus skeletons aren't that smart. Come on. Okay. Sorry, skeletons are friggin' annoying to me. It's still pretty... Where's the moon? Hold on, people. I need to check where the moon is. Okay, so the moon's that way. And since I don't see it in the sky right now, so it's probably close to being day. Yeah, it's pretty close to being day right now. And so yeah, when day comes, oh jeez, that thing is good. Those things really suck at aim. When day comes, the some of the creatures of the night, such as skeletons and zombies, they burn. Of course, they're, those are only skeleton zombies. Unless you have a that one percent chance, known as a spider jockey, which hopefully we'll never see. Oh look, there's a zombie. Oh god! Go away! And since this is the first, uh, your since this is the first Minecraft video I've done, it's probably not that good. So give me some pointers on what I should do here. Please leave a message in the comments. I mean, besides move out of that little hidey hole over there and get building. Uh, tell me what you think. And I think that zombie's above me somewhere. Yeah, he's up there. Yep, there he is. Hello, zombie. See if I can drag him to the fire. Oh, he died before I could get him there. Anywho, um, yeah, there's another one somewhere. Huh, anyway, but yeah, other than move out of that little hidey hole and get building, uh, tell me what you should think I should do, like. Probably make this building out of stone. Make it like the Yog Cave. And if you don't know what that is, uh, go to you like since you're already on YouTube. I almost said go to YouTube. Uh, type in Yog's Cast. How to survive your first night. Looking for the one the picture with the red, red and white lettering. And yeah, watch those guys. They have a really good series of videos. Uh, they're they're really funny. They do uh, let's plays, adventure maps. Which, if I get enough subscribers and views and all that, I think I might start doing those too. So uh, yeah, if you like my stuff, like it, subscribe if you haven't already. If you have, thank you for sticking with me this long. And if you are like willing to contribute to my efforts, uh, go to a uh, my friend Lego Kid 184's channel. We have a server. We have a server going up soon. And yeah, tell him Kaboo sent you, and he'll probably he'll probably let us in. But be warned, watch the video first, because we do not allow any griefing. The first time someone griefs, we immediately ban him. So yeah. Be warned, because we've had to put up with tons of griefing. 
so yeah thank you for sticking with me this long and as your final sign off view I'm gonna go destroy these two chickens ah! Ah! get back here chicken ah! 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 okay later people